Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel of SAS Track. And if you are new to this channel, then don't forget to subscribe to our new channel. In today's video, you will see a detailed video of how Binom affiliate tracking software works and what all it offers us. Let's start. Binom is a self-hosted tracking platform and is a leader in click processing and report building, which results in optimum business decisions. It is effective tracking software that may be indispensable when it comes to eliminating the tracking errors and miscalculations, as it helps you do away with such errors and thus increases the ROI of your campaigns. So let's begin with Binom review. Sign up to Binom using the link mentioned in the description to get a 30 days free trial and also some additional discounts. Once you sign up on Binom, it will lead you to the member page. It is the dashboard page you check your active subscriptions, see the useful links provided along with the active resources. You can install the Binom server here. Check the installation guide and also contact the support live chat if any queries. You click here to check the server requirements, what are the minimum requirements which are needed to get the desired performance and know about the daily traffic volume. Then you have automatic installation. This type of installation allows you to install all the necessary software along with the tracker and optimize it for your server in 10 minutes. But if you want to install the server on the web panel, then it's better to opt for a manual method. In the manual method, simply check the software requirements and install it on web panel, ISP, Plesk, etc. You can also find a quick glossary of the technical terms which are related to the software. As I have already installed the software in my system, you can see that here. Let's move ahead and see the main features and functionalities of Binom. Let's head to the section where there's daily and regular work campaigns. Click create and start filling in the details. It leads you to the new campaign page. On the left of the page set the basic parameters of the campaign. Name. Type the name in the right corner of the box. You are given an option to change the color of the campaign name. Group. Select the group to which you will relate your campaign. It's convenient to group campaigns by verticals, countries and types of traffic. Traffic source. Select the traffic source you have to add it in advance and set it in the traffic source fields. CPC. Use this field to specify the cost per click at which you buy the traffic. CPM. Cost per thousand clicks. CPA. The cost of the click will be reassigned with the conversion. Hide referral. This is used to hide your landing page from the offered network. Domain. This item will be visible if you add additional domains in the domain field. In this case, you can choose the domain of the campaign. The campaign URL will be generated on it and the URL will be the main domain will work too. Add the type of distribution, normal rotation, smart or fix on. Campaign URL is a link where you should send your traffic. It's generated after saving the campaign. It contains all tokens configured for all the traffic source. You can check and edit the additional settings from here. Add a related description in the editor available. Save from here and close the window when done. Moving to the lander section. Here you can see some of the landing pages. You can check the groups which they belong to, the number of clicks, leads, CR, revenue, cost, profit, ROI, etc. Let's see how to create landing pages from here. When using our tracker, there is no need to store the landing pages on the same hosting service with the tracker and use PHP code for them. Simply need to insert the link. To proceed further, you can take the URL from the settings option in the click URL field. Once you set the correct link to your lander, you need to add it to your system. To do this, press the create button in the landing pages section. Enter the name of your lander into the name field in the system. Enter your lander URL in the URL input field. You can use tokens to pass different click parameters to the lander such as device name, 
operating system and the user's browser country city operator groups are needed for a quick search when you select a landing page in your campaign settings or to view the group statistics in the offer section it's possibly to group by vertical category type of traffic and so on you can also group landers based on your personal work system to add a new group choose from the list the add new item under the list will appear a new field for the name of the new group choose the lander language in the language field and click on save the lander will be added to the system moving towards the offer creation to create a new offer in the system press the create button in the offers tab the following window will appear name tracker doesn't generate the offer name based on other parameters and give you the complete freedom of naming your offers use your system i personally prefer saving the name with numbers so that i could find it easily specify here the link to the offer from your offer network add the country name as when you append an offer it's desirable to indicate the country for international offers this field can be left blank choose the group as groups are needed for a quick search when you select an offer in your campaign settings or to view the group statistics in the offers tab you can specify the fixed payout for each conversion from here or simply tick the auto option in this case the tracker will get the value from the payout token which must be indicated in the post pack url in your offer network select auto or upsell as per your desired need also select the conversion cap and click on save if you use a lot of campaigns with one conversion funnel you can use the rotation system create rotation and use it in several campaigns in that case changing different flow settings in the rotation will be applied to all campaigns with that note with that rotation let's see how to create rotation go to rotations and push the create button in the left part choose rotation name group if required in rotation statistics there's a possibility to present them to a specific group in the campaigns tab you can add campaigns that will use this rotation but be careful when you save rotation traffic in these campaigns will instantly start to flow by the rotations path instead of the path within the campaigns let's move ahead and know about banom affiliate network the affiliate networks is beneficial so that you could split your offers over networks and analyze statistics of each when you need to create a large number of offers for one affiliate program it's convenient to use templates once you have set up the template you can add to the link tokens that are relevant only for this affiliate network in two clicks tracker already has a pre-installed catalog of popular network templates in the same directory you can immediately register in the network or vote for it in case you can't find the needed template you can create it manually just fill three fields name offer url template post box url apart from this using binom you can also work with various traffic sources that are displayed on the traffic sources tab each source you can set up individually or take one from the built-in templates name source name post back url url for sending conversions to a traffic source external id clicks id from traffic source mandatory for post back url cost token to pass click cost from traffic source there are also some additional setting which includes traffic loss here you can set the percentage of traffic loss from the source post back percentage the percentage of conversions that will be sent to the traffic source for example at 50% the tracker will send every second conversion payout percentage the payout percentage that will be sent with the conversion to the source with a real payment of $10 and 50% setup the tracker will send only five dollars to the traffic source you can see the latest trends based on the date clicks lpctr 
leads etc you can also see the insights in the form of graphics moving ahead to the conversion section you can find information on this page about each of your conversions that is leads in this section you can manually add conversions to the tracker to do this click the update conversions button and download the conversion report using dot csv button you can also make a search by adding filters so that you could find the specific information on a specific conversion sometimes you might need to get additional information about requests coming from affiliate networks in the tracker also you might need to know what and when was sent as conversions from the tracker to traffic sources there is the conversion log in the tracker for all of this you can see both incoming and outgoing conversions here moving ahead with triggers triggers are the first step to auto optimization of your campaigns with properly configured triggers you will worry less about block domains sudden drops of ROI or LPCTR disable offer links and many other abnormal situations simply add the basic information your work logic etc each trigger includes three functional settings condition the main condition for triggering actions the action to perform about triggering notifications the notification after triggering moving towards the users section get the complete list of the user section from here you can easily add and create a new user from this section simply add the basic information and grant the permissions which are able to be provided okay guys this was a quick review of Binom affiliate tracking software and now it's the time for you to sign up for a free trial using the link mentioned in the description below and try these features by yourself don't forget to share your tracking experience in the comment section below. Moreover, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, then click on the subscribe button and notification bell next to you. If you like this video, then hit the like button or if you have any questions, then write it down on the comment section below. Thank you.